Hey y'all, welcome to Angel's Rule. Today we will be fixing up our gate for Christmas. So what we decided to do was take a grapevine wreath and go ahead and spray it because it's gonna be outside and we wanna protect it from the elements. So what my husband did of course was protect our window. Uh, we're gonna be using some, a type of lacquer, it's UV rated. Um, we use it for some other projects so it works really well outside. And so we just hang it up and we're going to give it a nice even spray all the way around. We'll let it sit out for 24 hours and then we'll be ready to decorate. So as you see here, I have everything laid out on the floor because I kind of want to see how it's going to look on the gate. Uh, all of the items I purchased, I purchased from Hobby Lobby. I got my ribbon. It was maybe about $4. I got this nice big uh, stick with the pine cones and the greenery um, I opted for the large one because I can uh, utilize it a little bit better and then I got these little uh, berries I got those at Walmart because it's the plastic ones so I don't have to worry about them being out in the elements in that way and then again the wreath um, that's a really nice large wreath so um, now that I kind of have it laid out um, I'm also looking at the garland to see if maybe I should put a little color in there. I'm not really sure at the time. I'm just was trying to figure out and mm, we'll just play by ear. If I need to add something to it, I will. But it had the pine cones already in it to mimic uh, the stick that I had that I was going to be putting on the wreath. So what I did here was go ahead and put the wreath on my crafting table and I kind of just looked at it and turned it around again just to make sure I had it uh, in the position I wanted. I got my uh, wire that I'll be using and my wire cutters. Um, so I made sure I had all my supplies there close because I wanted to go ahead and get everything moving. Uh, what I usually do when I'm working with the wire, uh, if I can, I Pull about what I think I'm gonna need and go ahead and pre-cut a few pieces that way once I kind of get everything affixed it's already uh, I already have what I need I'm not trying to hold it and cut the wire at the same time so that's just uh, something that I do that helps save time and help me get things uh, get things done quickly so after I cut that then I will look at my stick and it's hard to tell from the video, but it's a really large one. And uh, as you can see, what I decided to do is take some of the greenery, greenery and move it down, like just push it down. It was easy to push down. So that way it kind of looked the same on both sides or it mimicked it um, and looked um, right once I put it down on the wreath. So that was really simple. And again, this is a maybe 32 inch wreath. So it was, you know, rather large. So the stick also needed to be pretty large in order for it to look significant uh, to go on the gate. So once I figure out how I want it, I went ahead and just laid it down and uh, moved it around so it looked nice on the wreath. And then I'll just start to secure it um, with my wire. And now that I've got all of that in place, I added in my berries and secured those, secured those on both sides and it gave it a nice little pop of color. So now we decided to go ahead and start putting everything on the gate. Uh, I opted to just leave the garland plain and uh, just put the uh, wreath 
up without it again less is more i like it to just be nice and simple as you see here but then i thought oh wow i need to add something else it's a pretty large gate and it just looked still looked rather small so at the last minute i decided to order some merry christmas letters um, off of amazon they were pretty large and they had really good reviews and so once we were able to get those in we just went ahead and went out and stuck those in the ground and as you can see here it looks beautiful i love it it looks amazing from the road uh, when you drive in with a nice little pop of color so again this is what we ended up with this year next year i'm sure we'll add some extra things to it but let me know what you think if you like it like I said, let me know. Leave me a comment. If you have any suggestions, let me know. Happy holidays, you guys.